Hey everyone, Tekin75 back in Eco with Gerald17. Hey guys. And we did a lot. A lot between episodes. Well, Gerald did a lot. Would you like to tell well, everybody? Well, it, it, it doesn't look like a lot because <laughs> what the majority that we did was Hello Alligator slowly coming out of there. That'd be a I creepy know. thing to see. Yeah. <laughs> An alligator slowly creeping out of here. So can you move? Uh, nope, you're going to eat me? Okay. All right. Um, thank you. There you go. <laughs> so, um, so uh, my mechanics book in there took uh, just a lot of materials. It took it yeah. took quite a few hours to sit there and melt all the the the, uh, the copper, the copper, and all the, the other stuff. Iron. And that was with uh, Tegan even helping me getting get it uh, that type of stuff. So yeah. So that's good. So, uh, but um, so. But I've got the skill unlocked. As you can see, I got a lot of stuff unlocked, and uh, mm -hmm. probably today I will st uh, will start the screw press. I've never done a lot of these ones in there, so I'm just going to keep working through my my machines. And right. then probably in between episodes, I'm going to have to expand the heck out of this place. So <laughs> I know it's going to. Yeah. Oh. Uh, yes. Yeah. Right. <laughs> yeah. 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 <laughs> and make this. I'd I, I'm still not liking this Picasso thing going on. So. Picasso. <laughs> but it took so long to make the other stuff in there. So, Tegan. Anyways, yeah, I'm just going to be planting a few more um, fields today. So I've got them marked on my map. Um, you can see I'm going to do beans, huckleberries, and then beets. Okay. And so, yeah, that's that's basically what I'm going to be doing. I All I did between episodes was, like, um... Gerald said is uh, I grinded out a few papers for him for basic and uh, advanced got rid of a lot of the mortared sandstone I had laying around that was good Yeah. and then used up a bunch of the food that I had made a whole bunch of <laughs> <laughs> and nobody's eating because there's only two of us uh, yeah only two yeah only two. but so yeah I plotted out this area for um beans yeah so what i did is once again i went to world layers plant group plants and then yield potential and i click on beans and you can see this is in a white spot so that is a really good place and i'm only gonna do one plot if i was on a server i'd probably do at least four if not more yeah, well, so. that, that gets a little tricky now with all the stuff that they used to put into there. But before you used to, you could streamline yourself to just a couple meals into there. But uh, now with the taste thing coming, and most servers have enabled it. Um, yeah, I make everything now. Yeah, everything. So farmers have to plant everything. <laughs> yes, yes, they do. <laughs> Yep, and uh, okay. well, I mean, it does make it hard because you only have a certain amount of papers, so you do have to kind of yes. plan it out a little bit, uh, unless someone, and our, our server, they've made it so the farmers can get a little, a uh, few more papers because they do right. want everyone to be able to keep up with stuff. Um, yeah. yeah. Yeah, papers, clean papers are the hindering, the hindrance to a large farms yep. Yep, yep. but if you have a good server with a good admin they realize that and they will you know compensate you for that all right mm, they will they will so that the beans are done i didn't eat a bean in the process of planting that is good <laughs> it does happen i know it does happen. <laughs> I don't know why. It's such a funny thing to think of the of, of the planting thing. Let's say plant, plant, plant. Go. Oh, no. I'm hungry. How? How? Yeah, but yeah. How? Why did I do that? <laughs> I just mindlessly stuck my hand into the sew bag and gulped down a seed. Yeah. I don't know. <laughs> I mean, when you're feeding snacks to a toddler or something like that, yeah, that'll happen because you've got the munchies in there, but it's like, yeah. <laughs> it's just not by uh, accident. Right, and I'm start, I am did right. start my advanced upgrade threes, which is great. Nice. Right, we'll good, good, good. Away. Good, good, good. 
Yes. <laughs> the the upgrades are the key to a lot of this stuff. And you might not yeah. think so because you look at it, it's like, oh, it's only a little bit of this, a little bit of that. It just, it makes it the adds world up. a difference. Yeah. It yeah. adds up. All right, so huckleberries are done. All right. That's good. And then I'm going to head over and do the beets. Yeah. So. Beets. <sighs> there are certain crops that uh, I've found that uh, there are certain crops that just, uh, the ones that you have to harvest completely up and reseed always seem to be the ones that take the most of the nutrients out there they're they're the ones that seem to always like need the most yeah you know. the resource hogs yeah they are so so they are they are yeah so i'm definitely gonna need a um yes wolf i'm gonna definitely need to um start fertilizer as soon as I can mm -hmm. so that I can replenish those nutrients. I think we've got everything. I've got like a butcher and then I did the um, tailoring. Cool. But tailoring has nothing to do with it. I'm a butcher. Yeah. So <laughs> yeah. tailoring is not... what is a tailor going to do with fertilizer? Anyways. And oh by the way, for anyone who's looking on there, yeah, I'm cheating a little bit. Sure. What? <laughs> so what? people might be asking in the in the back who are new to the game. They're like, hey, uh, uh, Gerald, you're sitting there and you're going and you're, uh, you've got your, your bloomeries smelting up iron. And you just ripped out your advanced upgrades. Now they're going to take twice as long. Ha. <laughs> Not after you've queued it. It Not. queues it with that in yep. mind, and then you can take it out and put it into a new machine. Yep. And queue up another thing, and then keep swapping them out. <laughs> yep. 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 So for anyone that's asking, yeah, no, it's the time still the same. The resources are the same. Once you've clicked it in, you've clicked it in. So it's, yeah. Is it a little? It's a cheaty? little cheaty, cheaty. Yeah. I mean, it's kind of. I mean, but. I mean, I did have the upgrade that's in there, so, I mean, if you wanted to, could you sit there and take an advanced upgrade, like, if you only had one of them, and queue up, put one in the machine, queue it up, put it to another machine, queue it up? Sure, you could do that. Um, yeah. yeah. That's, that's it, a lot of it, work. It gets, it, it, yeah, <laughs> I mean, it's a lot of work. Eventually, when you've got the funds, I would suggest, yeah. you know, you... <laughs> yeah. getting but, them but you know they are expensive in the beginning so i get it but if you are on a server and and because i know a lot of people in the beginning will start queuing up a lot of these upgrades in there but after a while people will kind of kind of forget about them and then it's yeah. like oh, i need them for my machine it's like up oh, you none so if you can acquire one this is a good way to do a lot of that stuff sit there and just okay you know yep Queue it up, pull it out. Or low on funds. Either way, mm -hmm. if there's not enough of these upgrades to go around or you're low on funds. <laughs> yeah. All right. How big is this screw press? All right. So. Oh. You're not big at all. I want. I'm done with my fields. I figured I would do them really quick. So. Sure. All four fields. These are the four that I need right now for the meals that I'm cooking since we're not doing the taste. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> I didn't realize about that I could, I don't know if I can enable it on a single player, like, because we're not on a server, and no. I'd have to go digging through files, and I just didn't even think about it before starting this, mm -hmm. but that would have been interesting to show people the taste thing, but. Yeah, well. It's okay. It will come. Right. <laughs> it will. As default, it will come. All right, so I need to do some, I don't know, mortared granite. I don't have enough. Oh, I'll go get that. Oh, because I made more brick. That's why I ran through all the... Okay, well, I have some more uh, sand. I'll make some more mortar. Sounds good. 
Yeah. I just did it again. I got my screw press going on, and I ripped out the, the one, and I'm <laughs> putting it the other. I regret nothing. <laughs> <laughs> regret nothing. All right. Oh, the animation's pretty right. cool for that. That should be good. I'll get some more sand in between episodes. All right. So I've got a third um, level going, pretty much. I wanted to... I gotta finish up the trim, the mortar to granite trim, but mm -hmm. <sighs> oh, I'll go throw it over here, and I'm gonna take down. Did I finish this? Okay, so I'm at 164 in this room. I haven't changed out the windows. I haven't changed out the floor. So what does it need? It needs. It's knees 1.8, so I definitely need to change out some of this. I'm going to probably change out the floor, and then my cast iron stove will be able to give us um, uh, more housing bonus. Cool. Yeah. Okay. Uh, I think I'm going to do this. There we go. So I'm at 167, so yeah, I definitely need to place out the floor. Oh, hi, All right. Threw up into my, uh, window. <laughs> now, technically, I think all I really need to do is actually, um, uh, I can get in here. <laughs> it's a little hard sometimes to get this particular spot. There we go. <laughs> you, can, you can hear the teeth I, grind. Uh, I... <laughs> <laughs> it's just... Okay, so I, if you just replace out all the, the walls, the ceiling, and then just the basically the edges of the floor, you should be able to um, get this up to 1.8. However, I'm going to have problems with that because I don't want to replace out this mortared granite. So it looks like I'm just going to replace out the whole floor. <laughs> <laughs> but if you didn't have that problem, you could just do the outside edges of the floor and be able to get the room up to the 1.8. You have to do the ceiling. I don't know why the ceiling is more important than the floor, <laughs> but <laughs> it is. So... If you do the ceiling, the walls, you're good. Okay. Cool. cool. All right. <sighs> ripping it out, ripping it out. Returning it to Gerald because he can make it into lumber. Yep. Which I'm making right Boards now. and lumber. <laughs> I pre-planned it, but uh, um, um, I... Oh, I went up and set the oh, mechanics cool. Um, the uh, <laughs> I pre-planned it a little bit because I saw it coming on there. My my that my electrical my mechanical grid was going to need more more stuff. So I yeah. just put up another windmill into there. So I was, but the minute I put up another windmill, it takes up I think a little bit of your lumber. So I had to utilize a little bit. <laughs> the hewn, yeah, it's fine. I got so much of it. No, not It'll the hewn, be... the lumber. So. Why did it take lumber? I think it did. I don't think it did. You don't think so? Maybe not. No. Okay. Well, then, then you're safe. <laughs> then you're good. You can't. You can't. You have to use a windmill in order to run your sawmill. That makes the lumber. Oh, that's true. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So it can't horse, yeah. be. Yeah, you can't just put the cart before the horse. <laughs> <laughs> oh, alrighty. Stupid cart. Okay. Almost done. Right. Digging this one out. There, there are different colored lumbers. However, they didn't do, in my opinion, mm -hmm. as good of a job with the color difference with the lumbers as they did with the hewn. Oh, well, yeah. 
I would have liked to have seen like the hardwood to look decently, you know, darker. A little bit. I mean, I know it's not going to be like dark, mm-hmm. but <laughs> you know, <laughs> <laughs> at least you know the way the hewn one looks. But it doesn't. They they didn't do that. It looks pretty much exactly the same. Yeah, they they could have just been trying to because they wanted to make you know the better looking woods and stuff like that with the better looking stuff in there. You can't make you can't make the the lower class ones look so good into there because then if you know people aren't using them in their builds as much except for just to upgrade. So. Well, they spent a lot of time on tier four making those things look good. Well, yeah, that, but that's the point. It's like I a, know, you can't, I know. Can't use the animations for the tier fours. This <laughs> is, I mean, uh, tier uh, tier ones. Yeah. Tier fours, yeah. So. Now, do I want to do what I normally do, like with these? I don't know. Uh, yeah, I will. Okay. I know. I, I It's aesthetic stuff here, guys. Aesthetics. <laughs> Not so much, you know, necessary at this point, but just me and my... Yeah. Does this design look good or not? <laughs> That's good. <laughs> the, the people that want the good-looking designs will, will, yeah. will look at your vid, and the people that just want the cobble boxes, <laughs> the, as we call it, with Minecraft uh, stuff. Uh, yeah, can, the cobble boxes. can look for mine. So... <laughs> A square box. <laughs> okay. The other server that we're on, we have. Uh, uh, by now, everyone's got these really nice looking looking uh, uh, places and stuff like that. And mine that's been around since the server started still is just a big wood <laughs> box. <laughs> yes, he's bringing my property value down. <laughs> bringing my property value down. That's awesome. <laughs> yeah, I've got this nice uh, bistro sitting next to a log cabin. I, I it's yeah. <sighs> okay. <laughs> I'm All right, I've decided to change again what I'm doing here. Sounds good. Normally I split it with brick, but since I'm doing this granite thing. Oh. I am going to line it with the granite and hopefully not pay the price. Hopefully I can still get this to 1.8 the way I'm doing it. We'll see. Yeah. We'll see. That is the goal that I have. All right. Oh, I, I'm going to, I don't need to kill these animals. I don't need to, <laughs> but they are in the way. And I might have to. <laughs> well, it's a different I... type of need. It's not a meat need. It's a, yeah. I, I don't like you. You're annoying the heck out of me need. <laughs> I know. It is that. Okay, so this, I use the floor part. And you can see it has this nice trim. I do like that. So that's why I wanted to... Uh, make the design because if I do that flooring without a border for each room uh, animals um, without a um, yeah without a border it's going to not look right so I have to uh, that I still need more I still need more lumber okay see I did that on at the top here and you see what I mean we've got this border but then it stops so I'm gonna have to remove this and then put the um, granite trim that I was doing so that it just looks a whole lot better okay I'll use this lumber here because I won't need it up there anymore Thank you. Up a little bit more. then I have to do it here too go all right so the floor is done I'm almost to 1.8 it looks like a one seven before I ran out of the room
this will also um, the quality of your building material will also help your housing score so the more I add tier 2 material the oh okay it's this one but I guess it doesn't really matter I'm getting stuck on stuff okay stop it <laughs> that looks better stop that stop. definitely looks better so I definitely need more granite Go carve out more granite. Unless that's what is over here. Okay. Yep. Oh, I gotta replace out the um the carpet. I'm really getting tired of being bum rushed by these animals. <laughs> <laughs> I know. Oh I my know. goodness. That's why they I'm like insane. I've never I've never seen an amount of killing that that re reduced it so much. I mean, they always warn you. It's like, hey, make sure not to kill yeah, too. Overkill, overkill. Don't, oh, don't overkill. Don't overkill. But it's like, um, yeah. I don't think that's possible. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Maybe it is possible. And somebody will be like, challenge accepted. Probably, but. As of right now. And I guess it really depends on how many people you've got on a server, too. I don't know, yeah. All right. So yeah. what do we have as far as lumber made? 14. Mm -hmm. Oh, it might need some boards made, but... Okay. I'm on my way there, and I can okay. queue up some boards. I was right. queuing up some hewn logs Oof. too because as much as you're taking out the the amount that it utilizes is is so small. So. <laughs> All right. There's a deer that's dead. <laughs> oh really? It was in the the on the way to uh, to my place. So. Oh yeah, because the wolves are busy too. Mm -hmm. All right. I guess I'll just. Do this. This. There we go. That evens it out. Okay. All right. So yeah, we're at 1.73. If I close it up, I really hope it works. <laughs> <laughs> I might have to put a lumber door in here, but so I know that if I put fuel in here, and then then even if I'm not using it, then it will count as housing bonus. But I'm really hoping I get to a 1.8 with this trim. <laughs> but I don't know. Yeah. I'm pushing it here with tier one, a combination of tier two and tier one. But yeah. All right. So you know what? I have a question for for our viewers into there. This is this is a good thing onto there. So we have I have quite a few tables onto here. And my question for anybody, if you can put it in the comments too, and, and I, this goes for, for Tegan as well for certain stuff, is would you want me to make all these machines on camera, or do you want me just to have them already made and then like maybe put them down? So I wouldn't mind getting some, some feedback for, from, from you guys there. Okay. Yeah. Does that make sense, Tegan? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I mean, yeah, because it's, um, it, it takes, I mean, we do a lot of the mats, you know, collecting off camera, mm -hmm. and then you do the, the building of it on camera. I don't know. How long is it taking? Is it still making? Well, no, it didn't take too long for this, okay? But if I have to sit there and we have to do one for every episode, because one clicks to another in there, like I say, like the assembly line, we've got screws. Screws are made in... Uh, is it the screw press? No, something else. I thought it was the screw press, but another another machine. And the idea is, is that each one of these things takes a while. So like the assembly line, it's 30 minutes to make one of those. Okay. Lathe three minutes you know portable steam engine although that's that's uh i think that's a part uh six minutes so uh some of these things i mean it just could take a while 
And so I, I'm just interested to see if people really want me to actually make some of these things. I usually, I, I don't make more than, like if I made one. One, one thing on there, I'm not going to spend time on uh, see, having you guys watch me make another of the same thing on there. So I'm just curious. I'm curious. So if you want to see it, that's fine. I'm, I'm good with that. If you don't, then that's cool too. <laughs> <laughs> I think I'm going to have to do something different than what I wanted to do here. Or at least I'm going to try and see if it's, you know... Oh, we're at the end of this episode, though. <laughs> it happens quick. That's yeah. why I kind of tagged that thing, because I figure we're coming to it close to we the are. end. So. We are. We so, <laughs> are. So, guys, hold on. They're not going what? anywhere. They're watching the video. No, no. <laughs> Okay, good job, honey. Okay, so if you like this episode, hit the like button below. If you want to see more from me or us, hit the subscribe button as well. Um, please leave your comments and suggestions down below. And we want to thank you for subscribing and clicking that bell. And we will see you guys next time in Eco. Bye, guys. Bye. Thank you.